Hey guys, welcome back to another Ultra Sun my English. Ultra Sun Wi Fi battle. We have a battle against Floor. I not how you pronounce the name. So, uh, he has a. Uh, he, I'm assuming the guy. I'm hoping. He has a rain team, but, like, uh, it. Like, less frightening rain team. Because he has a Pelipper that. When you have Drizzle, it part, it means OU, basically. It, I don't think you can do any tier with a Pelipper. And I think Pelipper is OU. But he has a. Uh. Uh, what is it? Calm down. Not in hit very too hard. So, we have an OU battle, you can say somewhat. Uh, but this battle turned out to be very good. That's why I kept it. <laughs> Let's hop into it, though. And I just hit the camera and I feel like jumping off a bridge. No! What the heck is this angle? I'm gonna have to restart. Uh, it should be, guys, it should be better now. Um, so, it's gonna leave it dust. I don't know what this thing is. <clears throat> so I'm gonna leave it Maguna because he doesn't have a ground type and if he does I have ice beam. So he's gonna touch me and first my uh that's a bit creepy. I don't want this vault switch because I don't know what this thing is gonna do. I'm predicting a real wish I don't think gonna real wish a special attacker. Uh maybe shadow punch. So I'm gonna go into that he actually just went for a trick room like no are you kidding me? I'm gonna do it trick room again. Uh if you guys notice my other battle, I don't like trick room. Uh, so is he gonna trick room toxic? Okay. Maybe because Juninja does a lot of work to his team, but he has Aldino in the back, I believe. Come on, using Aldino, help me. So I'm gonna use, uh, dog pose. <clears throat> Not enough. I'm gonna, well, it is enough. I'm gonna take this out. Uh, but he did tox me, toxic me and put me on a timer. That is very annoying. So, uh, now that you can listen to this could live a dog post because Salt Rest is an Escalier, whatever. Not, what the heck is Selgo? What the hell? I'm gonna send two OP for Weedle. And I'm believe I'm just switching into, uh, he actually went for the Mega Hunt. That's something I'll see every day. So that actually did a lot. I'm just saying. That's minus one and that did that much. Yikes. So he's gonna swamp out. He actually named it Lance. Interesting. I'm gonna send Pelipper. <clears throat> but um, we read those. I predict him to switch out, and I'm gonna click my Z move. Well, Z move hit every in on his team, but uh, flying in Z because I ain't Rito. I say then if you guys understand the nickname, it's too OP for Rito. <clears throat> I. Flying in Z, I mean, uh, we don't find it broken. It, it, we don't, if, you, if you're watching this, please comment below and let us know if you find it broken or not. So I'm going to one shot, but like, probably defensive power play. I have enough attack investment on this Landris to one shot Tiny Grow Bow Nature. So, yeah, uh, that, it, the power play is gone. So I'm afraid of adaptability, Aqua Jet, or oh, any move. So send my Bulu. And uh, he make a good play, I would say somewhat, because he went for the uh, well, he went for the camera because it, I would blow my lanterns ray and I did damage. Hold up, I don't know it, because he I don't see any item. He not life form, so I wasn't sure what item he has. So he's gonna switch in extra blue, a good switch in this. I don't know why I click hand leech. I know he's gonna switch in that. Uh, if you guys notice the damage, I am. Uh, what is it? I am a, a bandit. Uh, well, this is an old team. <clears throat> I had too many battles with this team. Uh, I'm sorry if you guys see this team too much. I'm trying to give you more load here as well. So I'm gonna switch up because the Iron Head is coming. So I'm gonna go on my two OP for Weedle. Oh, it could be Mega Hun again. That did a lot. So I'm gonna intimidate this, and this is gonna hit me up with the Iron Head. And that still did it a lot because I, I'm okay. My EV spread is ridiculous. It uh, uh yeah, this Landris is like the genius set. I'm kidding. It's just a Landris set. So he's gonna switch up. I'm gonna go into his Aldino probably to get the trick room up. I'm gonna get my rocks up because all this switching around make me uh very mad. But I don't have my stock cocks up. So the uh the, the red will go away. No, I'm gonna miss the stone edge. But you know we all know it's not gonna do anything. I'm gonna get the trick him up. So I wasn't sure what this Aldino can do. Toxic is the best thing he can do. 
a flamethrower if he has it. Uh, but I'm not gonna do anything. He's gonna use toxic. Uh, I am a somewhat wall. I'm not really forward defensive because I, if you know me, I like offensive teams. You're gonna bring star to me. I'm not gonna bother uh, keeping the battle. So that stone edge did nothing. Even two stone edges were doing nothing because this this uh, ugly uh, Audino has been regenerated. Uh, so he's just gonna swap out and go into es or whatever. I'm gonna pull a switch because I'm poison. I'm gonna go into my Magiona, but there's actually not the best. I don't really have the best matchup unless I have HP Fire on this, I'm not sure. And Iron Head can flinch me down because of Trick Room. So I'm gonna go into my Zapdos. Hopefully, I can wall this, unless he has Rock Slide, but I don't think Escavillo gets that or runs it. So he actually drew one. Interesting. So he knows Heat Wave is coming, and uh, he's gonna send Arduino. Uh, I think I just click Discharge, now I click Heat Ray. And I just bounce off Naldino's body. And he knows the trick. And this man actually know what he was doing. That actually good. I like that my opponents knowing what they're doing. So I'm sending my Megiona. And he's just gonna rush. Like, are you kidding me? Which way to regenerate him? So, so let me just bring this Pokemon out of my face. So, I'm gonna just flow kinda and see how much it does. I'm curious. And I was predicting a switch, actually. And not enough. So I do drop my special attack, and he is just gonna go for the trick room. So you can use protect uh, if he has it. Oh, just switch out to get his uh, you know ability. Oh no, uh, he switched out. He uh, he got hit. I am minus two, so I really can't touch this. So he's gonna switch out. I'm gonna volt switch because I can. <laughs> uh, he's gonna send crowd out. I am minus two, so the volt switch not gonna do anything. I think this is a bit questionable play, but he didn't know my set, to be honest. And I'm at minus two, so you saw how much little that Volt Switch did. So I'm gonna go into my to tacos, yum. The bad news about this is I am taking down. I'm ta Trickum is up, and he can just reach in my blue for his next one. I'll just switch out, you know, save the uh, broken card out. <laughs> Yikes. So I'm gonna go. F he's gonna swap up. We wanna keep his card out. I'm gonna go into his. I can't read that. They can learn as Aldino, but Aldino is not really a uh, homely. I just went super power. We punish people. I was putting him to switch out into someone that won't take it, but I need this Aldino out of my face. I annoying as hell. Because they are rich, passionate, passionate with regenerated. Do you know how annoying that can be? Anybody face Ala Loma, whatever that. I probably choked the name. That Pokemon is annoying as hell. So he's gonna send an Escavalier. I think I said that all correctly. So I'm gonna send in Zap for free. So I do have a uh, static, but I don't need a static. No, I don't have static on this one. I have one with static. So he actually Z move me. He actually has the sa Savage Spin Out. Damn my Spin Out, my poor flying Gen 1 bud. That was so good though. Back Gen 1 was like amazing. Minus the uh, typing. When you have a uh, poison Riku bug in Gen 1, the hell? Bug is super fitted against poison types in Gen 1 for some reason, don't know why. So, um, so somebody have to explain to me why that was. I played Gen 1, so I know. Missing that yellow version. Good moments. So, uh, he's gonna Z move, that still did a lot. He's gonna try to iron flinch me because his trick is up. And he could flinch me, that just still did a lot. That was a defensive, and he got a crit. And he flinched me, like, oh my god, help me. I like, oh my god, I need like two more turns to left for this. If you get two more crits, I'll uh, hit one more crit. Trick him is finally over, so he's gonna switch out Lance. Do not know why it named Lance, I do not know why. Uh, and he's gonna send Crowd out. Do not know, uh, maybe predicting Heat Way, but I actually went for the Roost. Uh, me, I should just let him take me out, or just get a free switch and not heal myself. Because I because Roost, I lose my flying time, but I do get grassy terrain in a little bit. Yeah, I eat grass. So the train is finally over, and I'm just gonna go for the discharge. Why not? And uh, my opponent played uh, well. I, 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 it actually was decent compared to the other people. Don't stay in on a problem that can just destroy it. So the cell goes is annoying as hell. So uh, he is gonna go for the me first. The good news about me first is it actually doubles the attack I he went for. 
And plus he, uh, that, so I didn't get the burn, like, I, the insult, he used my move against me, then he'd get burned. So, uh, he, maybe he's gonna take this out. And, uh, I'm gonna get some rough footage. And now I'm gonna send Lance, uh, pretty much Zapdos does clean up, that is a good game to floor. <laughs> I don't want to butcher this man's name. You guys know what his name is. I put in the description and you can read it. So he we can do with this. So yeah, I shouldn't be playing aggressively. With I don't know what, how he plays. So me predicting the uh, extra layer or anything that we to fighting. Because he does have uh, the bug type that can take it. And his ghost type by one shot at the beginning. So yeah, good game to my opponent. And uh... Let's hop into the next battle afterward. <laughs>